Okay, hey, it's Jackie. I haven't made a video in like over a year, so let's see how this goes. I'm going to talk about the pressures of growing up, and this is going to be like within high school and with your parents. So I'll start with high school first because that's what most of you are probably familiar with. So yeah, I am in high school, and there are a lot of pressures in high school, especially if you go to a school like mine where it's a prep school and they're trying to prep you for going to college. And in reality, do you even know what you want to do? Do you know what you want to be, where you want to live? And no, nobody knows that when you're in high school. I mean, unless you've been planning this since you were like six years old, then the story you've made up in your mind probably is all fucked up anyways, and it's wrong. So, yeah, you don't know what you want to do. You're young. It's not fair to you that... This is, I guess, kind of high school slash your parents. But it's not fair to you that you're only probably 16 or 17 when you're making these decisions. And it's going to affect your life forever. I mean, of course, you need to start at some point doing your life. But it's not something that you're going to start in high school and it's going to change your entire life. I mean, that's not fair to you. It's not fair to anybody. Um... So we'll move on to something else because I could rant about that all day. Um, another thing in high school is when everybody else is getting their licenses and it's like, oh, I need to get mine. Well, yes, it'd be really good if you had your license because it's helping you become an individual. But you should never feel pressured to do that. I mean, come on. No. Um, and parties. Okay, this is a big deal to me. When there are parties in high school, you do not have to go. Because, like, I go to a school that has, like, 200 p people. And, yeah, if we have parties, they either get insane or they suck. So we'll go to ones from other schools. And sure, but you should never feel pressured to go. I mean, I know people who only go to parties because they feel like that's the way to fit in. So, yeah, it may be the way that you can get into groups, but if partying and what includes the parties with usually drugs and alcohol is what you need to get into a group, then you probably just shouldn't be in that group. I mean, come on. Because, like, the first thing that I said, like, the decisions we're making now are going to end up affecting our lives forever. Do you really want something that you decide to do just to get into a group of people that you're not even going to see again after you graduate? Do you want that to change your entire life? Because in reality, no, you don't. Um, another thing in high school is probably the clothes. And this is not to guys. Like, if you're a guy, you can just stop watching for a minute, like, tune out and be like... Um, but with girls, clothes. Why is it so important to you that you have to be like, Oh my god... Um, they're wearing maxi skirts. I need to go buy a maxi skirt and then I can fit in. No, that's absolutely ridiculous. First of all, unless you're required to wear a long skirt, most girls won't. Second of all, why are you trying to fit in with your skirt? The style's going to change in two weeks anyway, so you just wasted 20 bucks on a skirt. I mean, wear what you want to wear. I mean, come on. I've had this shirt for two years and it's my favorite shirt. I don't care. If it's freaking winter or summer, if it fits me and the temperature's okay outside, I'm going to wear it because it's comfortable. That's gonna, how it's going to go. And that's how it should be for most girls, I guess. I mean, be yourself. If you like fashion, then go ahead with it. But if you're just doing it to fit in and it's like a pressure, don't do it. Be yourself. I mean, it's the most cliche thing ever to say. But just be yourself. I mean, there's nothing better than somebody being themselves. And yes, I understand that in high school, of course, people are... Okay, I'm trying to not cuss as much. It's not really working that much. People are just not nice. And sometimes, or most of the time, they're not good to people who be themselves because it's different to them. And of course, that's always going to be a problem in society. People don't like different but they're never going to start to accept it unless there is different out there. I mean, 
I know I said it in my other video, and that was a year ago, and it still applies to me now. I'm a weirdo. Everybody is a weirdo on the inside. You just need to show it. And, yeah, that's being yourself. I mean, weirdo is kind of a bad term to use, I guess. Just be yourself. You could be obsessed with something. I don't care. Science. Um, art. I don't care. Acting. Sports. But to someone on the outside, that would be perceived as weird. And to you, it's just kind of like, yeah, I like that. It's like, I enjoy that. It's my thing. And I love that. I mean, come on. Okay, I'm kind of like dragging this on. I don't want this to be a 10-minute video. So, um, pressures with your parents. Okay, so with my family, it's probably a bit different than yours. My dad wants me to believe that I'm a five-year-old girl, but I'm still growing up. I mean, like, you can see back here, I'm not allowed to change most of the stuff back here. But, you know. Parents. Um, and, yeah, they want you to grow up, but they still want you to be that little kid. I mean, we're treated like kids, but expected to act like adults. It's not really fair. But part of it is we're not responsible and we're expected to go from having our parents take care of us completely to automatically waking up one morning and being like, oh, I'm going to make the bed, I'm going to go do the dishes, and stupid stuff like that. But it doesn't work that way. I mean, these are things that you build up over time. It's not just you wake up and you're completely an adult. Um, in high school with your parents, there's the pressure of growing up wise where you need to, this goes along with the first thing, to make your decisions. You need to know what you want to do, and you need to get a job, which I think is a great thing for anybody, because it's always great to be independent. Um, but really, I just think that it's a pressure for you to be forced to do these things, and you may not be ready. I mean, people mature differently, and it's just not really fair to make someone do that. I guess I'm saying. I mean, I'm sorry if this is just kind of a rant to you. It pretty much is. But, um, I mean, kids today, or kids all the time are getting pressured to do these things. And I'm not talking about peer pressure and all that stuff to do drugs. I mean, I did say going to parties, but I don't mean to do the drugs. I just mean to fit in. Um... But with parents, it's always a bit different because if you say no, it's kind of like, oh, I don't know. I disappointed these people who took care of me my entire life. So, like, you're kind of stuck. But I think that if it comes down to it, you should always just be doing what is best for you. Are you ready to make a lifetime decision? No. Then wait. Just wait. Don't make a decision that could alter your life forever. Just wait maybe a few months, a year, more than that if you have to, which maybe may not be ideal, but just wait and then make that decision when you're ready. And I mean, nowadays, you can change your mind. In America, you can go to college without having already picked your major, which is amazing. Um, so yeah, there's a lot of pressures I wish I could say more, but I'll end up having like a three-day video. So I'm going to end it now before it gets to ten. So yeah, I'm Jackie. Please subscribe to my channel if you want to or you liked it. Um, you can comment below and tell me if you want me to make a video on something else. I mean, I don't really care. I'm here. This is kind of like my rant channel, so if you tell me something to rant about, I'll do it. Um... So yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully I won't wait a year to make another video. Bye!